Hey everyone, welcome back. It's Dean and Andrea, and today we are bringing you another furniture flip. This piece was a commission piece from a girl on Facebook Marketplace who saw one of our previous pieces and just loved it. And so she actually picked all of the hardware, the paint color, and brought me her piece of furniture to do for her. We're excited to share this piece with you, so without further ado, let's dive in. This was actually the first time that we saw this piece all put together because our clients brought it over with the drawers out of it and it was just such a unique piece with these really cool, elegant details. After cleaning everything really well with the TSP substitute, I give everything a good scuff sand. I am using Bondo again to fill the existing hardware holes and I have really been enjoying using it. It dries really quickly, really hard, gives a really smooth finish, but you do want to work with it very quickly because, like I said, it does dry very fast. After the Bondo dried, I sanded that down and had to use my detail sander on some of the smaller, harder to reach areas. I blew everything off with my leaf blower and then gave everything another good wipe down to get all that dust in preparation for primer. For the first time, I am spraying my primer on this dresser, and if you've been watching our videos, most of the time I have rolled it on, and that is really just because it's a little bit messier to clean since it is a shellac-based primer. So with some encouragement from a fellow furniture painter, Katie Scott, I finally went for it and decided to spray the primer, and this was the perfect time since I had a bunch of interior doors that needed the same primer as well. Because as we've mentioned in our last few videos, we have two full bathroom renovations that we are so excited to share. I always do a light sanding with 220 grit sandpaper after each coat of primer and paint. For this piece, we decided on this beautiful muted sage green color. And just as a side note, FYI, I do always try and include the pink color and other products I use in the description. And as usual, I apply two coats of paint followed by two coats of top coat with a light sanding in between each coat.
Finally, it was time to put it all together, so we brought it inside and got ready to install the hardware. Now, normally you'll see me stage my pieces up against our brick wall in the living room, but since this one was for a client and it was already paid for, there was really no need to stage it and get photos, and it just looked so pretty here in front of the windows with the curtains behind it and was so beautiful on its own that I didn't feel like we needed to add much staging to it. Well, I love the way this piece turned out. It's just so simple and yet elegant. I love it. Yeah, I really love just the elegant simplicity of this piece and the color I think might be one of my favorites. Yes. And like I said, the customer actually chose all of the hardware. She approved the color that I presented her with. And I might personally have tried like a brass or even some wood poles on this, but they really liked the black. It fits their space and I love the way it looks. It looks really good. Well, that's all for this video. We hope you enjoyed this flip and definitely stay tuned because we have two bathroom renovations coming up that we are just so excited to share with you. The projects were big, the videos are huge, and so just stay tuned because those videos are coming up and they're going to be so exciting. All right, here we go. I'm going to get the microphone and see if I can make it. That's not a fog. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I'm just waiting for it. You can do this, babe. I believe in you. Yeah, I got all the energy in the world right now. I Where really. You I, to it's so elegant. It's just beautiful. <laughs> you know, I haven't messed up once. I'm just saying. Well, good for you. You're a pro. I am. I'm a pro am. Okay. <laughs> I win. Thank you. Yes, I'm just being silly, babe. I'm trying to make you laugh. It's not funny. I'm trying to make you laugh. So you stop I'm not so laughing. Hard. Okay, go ahead. Are you ready? Uh-huh. I'm closing it. That's it. Done. Done. Done, son. Done. That's it. That's the world? No. That's the whale. Oh, the whale?